I grew up with this sense of this body is me. This is who I am. And yet I am an infinite being. I am much greater. And I don't actually fit in this body. This body is in my being, which when I first started playing with that concept, it did not compute. My brain can't make sense of that. It's like, no, no, this is me. My being is inside of me. My soul is inside of me. Who I am is inside of me. And yet it is and it is not as beyond that. Yes, it's inside of this body and it's also way greater. It is everything. We are one. We are all that is. And so through this, I've learned to be more expanded. And not in every moment. I definitely have my moments where I try to stuff myself in this body and often through judgment does that really well. When I get judgmental of myself or others or situations, I contract and I am not that expanded being anymore. But when I take a second and go, oh yeah, that's not who I want to be. That's not who I choose to be. Then I can breathe and expand into all that is. I can be who I truly am. And I invite you, as Marilyn did in her beautiful prayer this morning, to expand. And expand beyond where you've ever expanded before. Please, I invite you to go much further. Further than the building that you're in. Further than this entire planet. Into the furthest reaches of the universe. And if you don't know how to do that, just ask. Because you are that. So you just ask, God, universe, source of all that is, please show me what it is to expand to the furthest reaches of all the universe I, further than my brain can even comprehend space is. And just expand into that. And what you'll notice is you are everything. You are all energies. You are love, you are kindness, you are joy, you are peace, and you are the opposite. You also are hate, you are war, you are sadness. We have all of these capacities. And when we don't judge them, when we don't think one is good and one is bad, but we simply accept what is, we get to be all that. And even Jesus got really angry and frustrated and sad. We are all of that. So if we don't judge ourselves for being angry in a moment, because maybe it's required, maybe that's exactly where and who we need to be in that moment. And yet, through that, we can have this choice, this willingness, and this demand in our worlds to be love even while we are angry, even while we are sad, to be this love because we are infinite, we are everything and we are everything all at the same time.